I'll wait for it to come on. All right, here we go. <clears throat> this comic recently completed his 300 <laughs> hours of yoga teacher training. That's a lot of time to hold that. What is that? Downward dog or some three? <laughs> yeah. Okay. I'll start again. I'm sorry. <laughs> This comic recently completed his 300 hours of yoga teacher training, which makes him an expert at opening up your body better than a police cavity search. Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> Please welcome Dutch Martin. Ladies and gentlemen, round of applause, Dutch <laughs> Martin. A boy Dutch. You know, folks, isn't it crazy how we all go through rites of passage at different stages of our lives. You know, at 16, you learn how to drive. At 21, you can drink. Well, last year at the age of 48, I decided to get some glamour shots done of my colon. <laughs> <laughs> now the word colonoscopy means different things to different people. You know, like that show Ghost Hunters, the only time you go looking for something and pray you don't find it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> now, first, there's the prep. Now, you can't eat anything for like 24 hours before, but then you have to drink something called magnesium citrate, which is yeah. like liquid draino for humans. <laughs> <laughs> they claim it's supposed to have a lemon flavor, but I don't think anybody in the research and development department ever had a lemonade stand as a kid. <laughs> See, they need to come up with new and different flavors for magnesium citrate to help it go down easier. You know, like Malibu rum. <laughs> now, it's crazy how the prep process, how preparing for, for a colonoscopy causes you to develop new skills, even new superpowers. Like during my process, I could put out a garbage fire through a screen door 25 paces. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> and after about 50 trips to the bathroom, I can knock a beer can off a fence at 30. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> With my back <laughs> Oh, jeez. Now let's talk about game day, the, ga the day of the procedure. Now I'm in my doctor's office. I asked my doctor, Doc, where do I put my pants? He said, right over there next to mine. <laughs> oh dear then the doc you know he goes out of his way to put me at ease to make me feel comfortable before the procedure so he puts on Barry White <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to undergo the most an invasive procedure known to man and all I can hear is I'm gonna love you love you love you <laughs> <laughs> I told my doctor I wanted to keep anything of value that he might find a like Jimmy Hoffa <laughs> I mean seriously I mean, the way I saw it, there could be some things that he might find up there I mean I did go to college <laughs> you know like that bag of weed I paid a hundred bucks for my sophomore year <laughs> Still don't know what happened to it. <laughs> now, my doctor said, Mr. Martin, we're going to report the whole procedure. We're going to film it. Would you like to see the film? I said, yeah, I want the camera view, mm -hmm. just not pay-per-view. <laughs> <laughs> and look, doc, I'm trying to build my social media following, so do not put it on TikTok without tagging me. <laughs> yeah, really. And then, just like that, it was over. It's crazy how quick and painless the whole procedure was, but I think my doctor enjoyed it just a little too much. <laughs> See, most doctors wash their hands after pulling out the probe. My doctor smoked a joint. <laughs> he found my bag of weed. <laughs> ah! Nice. <laughs> And I still had to do the walk of shame. <laughs> now, two weeks later, my doctor calls me and says, Mr. Martin, we actually did find some things of value that you might want to be aware of. We actually found two 
precancerous polyps. I said, well, you know what, Doc? Consider those my gift to you. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, you know what? I wonder if I donate them, can I write it off on my taxes? <laughs> <laughs> wow. I dodged a bullet, folks. It's a good thing I got those glamour shots done. <laughs> hey, if you want to improve and increase your social media following as well as save your own life, get your colonoscopy glamour shots done today. You might even get a bag of weed out of it. <laughs> uh, my name is Dutch, and I approve this message. <laughs> <laughs> nice job, Dutch. That was funny. Yeah. Uh, 